Hey guys, so this is another case of, um, I want to swap this fan out and I haven't made a video of it yet. I got this recently um, and it has no label on top of it except for like, like a uh, quality control label. But otherwise there's no labels on it and it doesn't look like there ever was there. It doesn't look like there ever was as well. Um, Cause it's in original condition and it's, there's no like, um, evidence of that any labels were ever on top of it so but chance told me it's a martech um by the blade brackets i haven't looked i've got some omega catalogs because omega used this motor as well um it's made by tat um i think it may be an omega because of the nuts on the bottom of the motor it looks like there isn't one but there's like a big flat head screw and um, that is an Omega thing that they did. And also the fact that it's not labeled, usually MyTech label stuff. So this is the fan. It's 48 inch white cane blades, obviously. It didn't come with a controller. The guy said he had the controller for it, but he didn't know where it was. I got it from a building demo place in Bunbury. Um, I think I actually did take a clip there when I was looking at it. Um, the blades were installed, like the blade brackets were installed, the, um, on, like the blades were mounted on the bottom of the blade brackets instead of on the top like they are now, which is wrong. So I put them on the right way, um, but because they've been on that for so long, they're kind of like the colours don't match anymore and there's the dust and stuff. But... I'll go ahead and start it up. It's on the, um, it's, it's on an SMC five speed control that I got that's labelled Watt Master. Started out on low. I didn't get a fan with that controller. Um, I got it from work. I removed it um, from a house that I was working on, um, and I took it as well as like a bunch of light switches and stuff. Doesn't really give the best range of speeds on this fan. Though low is kind of fast, or all the speeds are kind of fast. But that's pretty much what low looks like. Go and put it on to medium low because it's a five speed controller. That's what medium low looks like. Put it on to medium. Medium high. And finally high. It was really out of balance when I got it as well. The blade brackets were very bent. Turn it off. Wait for it to spin down. You can see next to it, I got an Arlec Little Max or an Arlec Zenta, uh, but that was a long story in itself, and I'll tell that story when I film that fan. I suppose I could do it now, but no, I, I, I don't think I can be bothered. After I've swapped this, I'm probably and done a couple of other things. I'm probably going to. Um, film the update video because I've changed a lot of stuff in here um, and I'd like to do that update video because I don't know how much longer this is going to stay like this because the new shed is going to be here very soon. I'm not going to say how soon because I'm not exactly 100% sure myself that it's going to be here very soon. I know that much. And I'm not going to make any kind of announcement video or another shed update. I'm just going to get straight into the moving blocks. has a longer spin down than I remember. Maybe its bearings have been improving since I've been using it because it, when I got it, it had a really short spin down. Okay, 
thanks for watching